Okay, here I am on the airplane. All these noise canceling. I've got the Beats noise canceling uh, over the ear. I've got the plug-in Bose. I've got the uh, AirPod Pros here. And I've got uh, the uh, Bose around the neck noise canceling. And uh, let me show you this little leather thing I've been using um, for airplanes. I'm kind of testing it out right now. Uh, but anyway, let me tell you what I like and don't like about each of these, which ones I would recommend you buy. Hey, uh, Dave here. So here's my conclusion uh, with the the all the noise canceling headphones, the AirPod Pros, the Bose uh, Quiet Comfort 30, I think they're called, and then the Beats. All of them are are Bluetooth. All of them are noise canceling, and I've used them for over a year now. All of them, and I want to tell you what I think. So uh, excuse me if I'm slurring and stuff. I just broke my toe, so check that out. Yeah, it's kind of a drag. My brother's calling. Uh, so here we go. Uh, this is the, uh, let me hear the pros. I would say these are great. All of them have their great things. These pros are great for uh, talking on the phone. If you're not going to be on for a, a long period of time, if you're in and out, in and out talking to people, uh, these are the greatest. Uh, they fit in your pocket. You hardly notice it. I clip this onto my bag or onto my belt loop, depending. Uh, but uh, they're great for the pocket. You hardly notice they're there. Uh, they connect really easily to anything Apple. It's fantastic. Uh, they turn off automatically. The other ones don't do that. So this, you, once you put them back in there, uh, it's off. And now they're charging again. The other ones, if you don't turn them off, you're screwed. So um, they are, and they use the same charger as my, all my other stuff. Um, and when you keep them in your pocket, the battery doesn't go below 32 degrees. And when it does, that kind of damages the, the battery. So they stay nice and warm because they're easy to put in your pocket. Okay, here are the cons of the pros uh, for the noise canceling. Uh, they're pretty good at noise canceling. Like, I, I enjoyed them. On the airplane, they work. Um, you don't even need them, really. Uh, but I like having them. So uh, they're, they're nice on the airplane, but they're not as good as the others. Uh, they're easy to lose. My brother lost his first set, his set, um, on under the couch or something, his kid got it. Then he found it, and then two weeks later he washed it. So uh, easy for that to happen. If you're moving a lot, or if you're in the hot tub, bathtub, anything like that, you don't want to have them in there because you're afraid they're going to drop out. Uh, the other ones don't. Um, let's see, the charge doesn't last as long. Uh, it's a couple of hours, hour and a half of using before you got to stick them back in. So one movie on the airplane, uh, on your device, and then you have to charge them again and go without. So I wasn't too big on that. The, the other ones lasted a long time. Um, now then, the bows, those are fantastic. Uh, the, the bows, well, let's go to the Beats first. So the Beats, uh, they're big and bulky for traveling, so I would never take them for traveling. They have a great sound. Um, they're great for watching movies with. Uh, one movie, 
one and a half, maybe two movies on a long trip because they start hurting the ears after a while. So you don't want to keep them on. Um, they have great bass and also they plug in. There's a, a wire that comes so you can plug it in onto the airplane or into any, any other thing. You can plug them in or you can go wireless, which is super handy. So uh, I really like that. If the battery dies on it, just plug it in. You're good to go. You don't get the noise canceling, but you can still listen. The other ones, not so much. Um, so their uh, noise canceling is excellent. They're good on the mower, good on the tra on the tractor. Um, you don't need to adjust the sound at all. I think they're fantastic. Now, uh, the uh, they do get hot and sweaty. Uh, if you're using them outside in the Texas hot summer, humid Texas heat, um, they can fall off if you use them if you move too much. Uh, they're not really for activity. Okay, those are the those are the the beats. They're not for activity, and if you don't turn them off, they will run out of energy. So then we go to the, the bows. What, here's what I found about the bows. Uh, the bows had excellent noise canceling also. I mean, really, it was my favorite one of all of them because the rubber has a lot of, like the silicone or rubber kind of plug into your ear. It's, it's almost too much, and so I didn't like that as much. But, but let me tell you about the, 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 con, the pros of the bows. So a uh, lot of bass, fantastic. You can adjust the noise canceling as much as you want. I don't know why you'd want to adjust less. Uh, the charge lasts a really long time. So it's like an all day kind of charge or several hours. You can watch, it, it really takes a long time to charge or it's a short time to charge, but it lasts a really long time. And then there's an ease of connection. So I have a Toyota Land Cruiser and and when I get in with these, I forgot to say, um, this car, I'll have these, I'm talking to someone, turn the car on, and then it goes to the car audio. And, but with the, uh, it kind of gives in uh, with the bows though, it stays on my bows, like it dominates. So it's a really strong connection to my phone. Uh, I like to drive with them and talk if I'm talking because it has a better sound for people listening instead of the car audio. Um, they're great for movie watching. So if you're laying down, um, you're on the, the beats, you'll hit the pillows, but these, uh, they're, they're just perfect. So they stay around the neck. Um, they're easy to adjust, uh, and most likely not, not to fall off. So if you want to get in the bathtub, whatever with the bows, they, they hang around the neck. They're not going to fall off running, doing whatever you're going to do. These are great, um, on a motorcycle, that sort of thing. I would totally use those. Uh, the cons is there's a slight hiss I noticed sometimes when it's just silent. I'm getting ready to call someone. I put them on, turn it on, and I hear a little hiss. I think that's the noise canceling. Um, but then once noise starts, that sound completely goes away, even in, in during conversation. But when you're just waiting, there's a little hiss there. It's kind of weird. Um, they take longer to put on. They are uh, they tend to slip around a little bit sometimes. They kind of turn after a while i didn't like that too much um they don't plug in on airplanes uh let me see so but the good thing is they have a nice charge a really nice charge and then there's no automatic turn off so the first few times i was using them i'd go to get them out of my bag and they're dead i forgot to turn them off so uh, those are the pros and cons i would say for traveling hands down the bows for around, walking around office in the car, just sort of hanging out, talking to people, talking on the phone. These podcasts, no music, things with no music, this for sure. They don't have as much bass, uh, the AirPod Pros. And then I would say third, uh, my third favorite would be the, uh, the Beats. They have great sound, but they're just too heavy and big and um, not great for traveling with. But my wife seems to like them. So thank you so much.